is breaking news from Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Good morning. We want to get you caught up on some breaking news developing on the east side overnight. It's where two restaurant workers are dead after an overnight shooting there. Yeah, so this all happened around 1 o'clock or so this morning. Kerry Klein is live for us near 21st and Post Road with a closer look at what happened and what we know about these victims. Kerry? Yeah, good morning, Ben and Anne Maria. Several hours later, and crime scene investigators are still on the scene. Take a look inside here the Jordan's Fish and Chicken near that intersection of 21st and Post Road. And you can see inside detectives, crime scene unit investigators working, carefully processing the scene. And they have been inside for hours since the discovery was made shortly after 1 o'clock this morning. Now, here's a look at what the scene looked like outside right after police responded to this scene. Now, according to police, a family member was trying to reach one or both of the employees, calling the cell phone repeatedly, and when they couldn't get an answer, they drove over here to the restaurant, went inside, and that is when they discovered both of the employees shot dead behind the counter. Now, police tell us it's two men. They are in their, were in their late 30s, early 40s. They also tell us that they were of Jordanian or Middle Eastern descent. Now, now, as far as what happened, that's what police are trying to figure out. Was this a robbery? Was this something more personal? Again, that's what police are trying to determine right now. If you have any information, you're asked to call Crime Stoppers at 317-262-TIPS. And again, you can give that information anonymously. But we still see a lot of activity here on the scene more than four hours after this incident happened. And again, police are not sure what happened. They're also not sure when the shooting took place. They only know that that family member discovered them shortly after one and made that 911 call. We're going to continue. Continue to monitor this case. Police are still working it, and any new information, we'll make sure to bring it to you on the air and on social media and on our website. Ben Amory. Such an unfortunate situation there. Carrie Klein reporting live for us. Thank you.